like Melbourne, still has its trams. But how long will they last? Opinion in the Queensland capital seems to be that the trams will be replaced by buses as they have been in other Australian capitals. The tramway system overhead wiring is also used to operate a small number of trolley buses. They'd be doomed too if the trams disappear. It would be the end of an era. Brisbane's tramway system runs on 122 miles of laid track. The average run from terminus to terminus is about half an hour. Each year, the trams carry an average of 75 million passengers, and the supporters of the tramway system say that trams move more people faster than buses. Those who want buses say that trams delay all the traffic. Brisbane has 260 tram cars in operation. 140 of them are the four-motor type, the first of which was built in 1938. The rest of the two-motor drop centre type. Four miles of track have been closed in the last five years. But this was caused by a tram depot fire at Paddington, which destroyed a number of cars. The tram system covers the city and suburbs, but how long will it last? Will Brisbane follow Sydney and other capitals and replace its trams with buses? Or will it, like Melbourne, keep the trams? Only the future can provide the answer. Music